Professor Fig, the Keepers have shown me... Has something changed? Blobgog and I have learned that the goblins are searching for another repository, <laughs> like the one we saw. And I discovered that they're building massive drills to help in their... Professor Fitzgerald seemed very... I see. Ranrock... And, sir, there's something else. He knew Miriam? They encountered each other at Rookwood Castle. She was doing research. That... He liked her so much that he let her leave with it, despite... I don't know what to say. She could win. I want to hear more of this. And, in fact, I'd like to speak with Lodgok directly. But we've no time now. We Believe it or not, it's... Incredible. Very well. You'll need the password to get past the... I don't know the headmaster's house elf. Will he even speak to me? I imagine... He is. So you'll need a disguise. I have just the thing. A polyjuice... Wait. Doesn't Polyjuice Potion require a bit of the person you want? It does. So, how do you already have Polyjuice? One never knows when such a thing may come in handy. Let's just say I felt the need to be prepared for anything after my... Now, time is of the essence. Drink up. How do you feel? Uh, incredible. I won't forget that taste anytime soon. <clears throat> How do I sound? Convincing. I've taken the liberty. As we discussed, you'll need the password from Scrope, who could be anywhere in the castle. She's taken to badgering the poor elf about Quidditch in the hopes that he can convince Black to change his mind. Thus far. I see. But what if Professor Black sees me? Leave him to me. I shall tell him where to meet a liaison from the Ministry in Hogsmeade. That should give you plenty of time. Thank you, Professor. I suppose we'll meet again in the match. It's rather strange to hear gratitude coming from <laughs> Professor Black. <laughs> I'll see you there. Now to find the Headmaster's house elf. Do you have a moment, Professor? Professor, I was hoping to catch you. I... Oh, I, um, places to be, Professor Sharp. Places to be. Of course, sir. Only, <clears throat> you'd asked me... I did? I did, yes. Well, spit it out, Sharp. I don't have all day. Probably best. I assure you, Sharp. Very well. I've brewed the cure for boils you wanted. I can drop it by your... cloak and dagger. Simply have a student deliver it. A student. I do. And thank you, Sharp. I just hope you... <laughs> now, to determine which student gets... Stand proud, purebloods. <clears throat> the future is yours. Greetings. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I mean... <laughs> <my wedding children. laughs> What could the headmaster want? When I witness what passes for magic in these halls, I... Headmaster? Hey then, what could he want? <clears throat> I wonder almost daily why I accept... Professor, a word? Professor Black? Again, we... We could still have trials and a somewhat shortened season. But the injury, Madam Kogawa. Professor, 
More than one student has taken a bludger to the head on our pitch. And they're fine now. The fact that it happened to be a pure blood, well, that's... What nonsense! That you would trivialize the health of a student over a, a silly game. A silly game? I... I have a good mind to write to the Department of Magical Games and... I should think you'd have better things to do with your time. <clears throat> now, where's my elf? I... Good day, Professor. And I spotted Scrope in the Great Hall. Seems to be avoiding me. Hmm, I wonder why. Good day, Madam Kagawa. What did we do to deserve him as a head? I haven't time for any of you at the moment. None. None at all. Move aside. Master, and he's coming this way. Miss Broom, a word. Oh, Professor, this is an uh, interesting. Remind me of your area <laughs> of affinity, Broom. OWLs are swift. Charms, sir. Nonverbal spells. Might work on. Well, keep at it, Broom. And before you know it, you'll be as invisible as that new fifth year seems to be. They're not invisible, sir. I've seen them near the library. In fact. <laughs> Something seems a little off with the headmaster. Has anyone seen my ivory-handled hand mirror? Of course. Professor, mm -hmm. I need to speak to you. Mm -hmm. Hello, Professor Black. Mm -hmm. Sir? Ah, uh, since I have you here, I wonder if I might... Oh. I've decided to give him a bit more uh, leeway with his time. Leeway, Professor? Are you sure that's wise? I confess I... Ah, well, yes. He... I see. But, sir, if I may, I am wary of how much time the new fifth... I've heard unsettling rumors of their escapades to confronting Ranrock's loyal... <coughs> what? <coughs> Goodness, you cannot believe everything you... <coughs> I mean, I shall keep an eye on Fig. You simply keep doing... I... well, I... Uh... Uh, good, good. That'll be all, Weasley. I, I mean, Professor... A wonderful job. Leeway for Professor Fig. I shall never understand that ever. That ought to give Professor Fig some breathing room. Scrope's as hard a worker as any has. Scrope! Oh, greetings, Master. Remind me of the password to my office. Oh, but Master made Scrope swear never to tell him. How dare you question me? I've a... Uh, uh, yes, sir. Uh, of course, sir. It is the Black Family motto, Master. Hmm. Right. Master does... <laughs> It's pure... Uh, uh, close, Master. Uh, Scrope thinks Master is indeed testing Scrope. <laughs> Obviously. And, of course, as Master knows, in French. Ah, yes. Oh, but Master knows that Scrope's French... Ha! Ah, thank you. Never speak of this conversation with me? Of course, sir. Scrope <laughs> shall try his best to keep out of... Uh. Ahem. Attention! The Polyjuice potion's wearing off. I best get out of sight. Uh, I didn't see what he was about to say. Ah, uh, made it just in time. It's wearing off. Fig was right. I can't believe it worked. Now, to speak the password to the gargoyle. What the hell is this person? 